Yo, what's going on guys? Benny Brooks here and welcome back for another video. Now, in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at what I think could be coming in the future for LEGO Super Mario 2023. Now, since we got Series 5 revealed, the next series that is due to release is Series 6, which is coming in January 1st, 2023. And for that, I have a few predictions that I think could be coming or could happen. Kind of far-fetched ideas, but really fun to talk about nonetheless, and also I'll show you some custom sets that I've made. All right, with all that stuff out of the way, let's just jump into my first idea. So one that I really wanna talk about is the Series 6 for character packs. I just made a custom Series 6 the other day. And if you wanna see that video, there's a card in the top right as well. But yeah, I feel like this is a very awesome awesome, good range of characters that we could be getting. There's Wimp, Orange Yoshi, Porky Puffer, the Pokey from Super Mario Galaxy, a big Goomba, Roy, the Chimp from Super Mario Galaxy, and also a Mario 64 Piranha Plant. And I feel like this is just a really solid group of characters. Next up is my Mount Magmeow Lego Super Mario Bowser's Fury set. The build for Mount Magmeow is honestly really impressive. I remember spending like a ton of time on it and it's one of my favorite videos on my channel. I also really like the character selection here. I think that it's really solid and it also represents Bowser's Fury, like the game really well in Lego form, which I really like. There's also like water all over the place. I feel like this is just a really cool set. I feel like Lego should do something like this because out of Bowser's Fury, Mount Magmao is probably like the most recognizable thing. Plus maybe we could get like an actual brick built Bowser's Fury Bowser. I feel like that would also be really cool. Another really cool thing that I think we could be getting, maybe not in wave six, but definitely in the future of Lego Super Mario, I could see us getting a interactive Captain Toad or an interactive Daisy. The interactive Daisy does sound a little more likely to happen just because we already got Peach and it makes sense to release Daisy. But Captain Toad has actually been played in past Nintendo games where Daisy hasn't really been like a main character running along in Super Mario Bros. Wii or something like that. I feel like both offer a lot. Like you could play four player with Daisy, but Captain Toad has like probably some special coin stuff or something. But in my opinion, I think Captain Toad would be a little bit cooler. Here's the build I made for his starter course, and I honestly really like how it turned out. But yeah, the last thing that I want to talk about is the possibility of Super Mario Odyssey being in the future. Here's my custom LEGO Super Mario Odyssey, the Odyssey. When I made this, it was really like, I didn't know how to do it. I think how it would work to interact with Mario is you would have to take the top off and like, put Mario inside or something and then fly it around. Or like there would be like a door in the back that you could just open and put Mario in. But then again, I feel like that's a little lazy. I feel like if they should make the Odyssey, they should make the Odyssey huge and have it be like a $120 set or something crazy like that. I feel like that would be really cool. Plus you could get like exclusive costumes for like wedding Bowser and like an interactive or like a power up pack wedding suit for Mario. That would just be so cool. Anyways, what do you guys think about these ideas? Let me know all your thoughts in the comment section down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. All right, see you guys later. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Goodbye.